If you're thinking about making a New Year's resolution, make sure your brain is healthy first. Dr. Daniel Amen's new book is Magnificent Mind at Any Age. And he joins us live in our studio this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Great to see you. Now, you have these imaging clinics all over the country. And how many images do you think you've looked at or done so far in your career? It's close to 50,000. 50,000. So you have a pretty good idea what a brain looks like. Why don't we take a look at a healthy brain from one of these images, right? Right. So these are spec studies. These all are right. the studies we do in our clinics. Mm -hmm. And uh, healthy is full, even and symmetrical. It's just four different views of the same thing. Okay, so this is what a healthy brain looks like. I want to take a look at an image of a brain that's been uh, damaged from drug use. Right, and when I first started doing imaging, I was the director of a substance abuse treatment program, and the images just looked terrible. And we have a poster that hangs down about 50,000 schools with these images. The real reason not to use drugs, they damage your brain. Does it, does it, it from, from this image, it looks like the brain has literally been eaten away. Is that well, these are blood flow images. So okay. what it means is there's low overall blood okay. flow so to the brain. So these are literal dead spots then? They're not dead spots. They're low, low in ac okay. activity. Right. And if you stop mm -hmm. and get on a brain healthy program, this the brain can, be can get much better. Really? Okay, that's very, all right. Let's look at stroke then also, because there's a sort of a similar sort of effect. Is it certain areas of the brain then that are particularly affected? Well, actually here, on the left side of the brain, you can see this hole. Now, yeah. this is a hole. I mean, stroke is dead tissue. Right. But around the dead tissue is tissue that struggles mm -hmm. that you can actually invigorate and make right. better. Okay, and finally, brain trauma. This is like blunt, blunt, blunt force, that sort of thing, car accident. Well, this is a soldier okay. whose brain was damaged in Iraq. Right. And the exciting thing is you can see the damage on the left. Mm -hmm. Three months later on the right treatment, you can see how those holes begin to fill in right. as activity becomes better. You literally can change someone's brain, right. enhance it, and improve their mind. We, we're going to put some tips up on a screen to keep a healthy brain, and they very much mirror some of the things that we talk about in day-to-day -day life about eating antioxidants, getting good exercise, trying to lower stress. All of those things that we talk about as building blocks for having a generally healthier life really pay off in terms of the brain? No question. And we can prove it because we've done many before and after images. When people change their lifestyle mm -hmm. in, in a good way, right. when they drink less, exercise more, right. learn new things, yes. take fish oil, it makes a huge significant difference in their life. And your brain is the foundation for your mind. With a better brain, no mm -hmm. matter what your age, yeah. your mind is better. The, the, we, in, in the hour version of this, which people can see on their local public television station right now, one of the things you talk about for older people, what's the what should you be doing as you get older in order to keep your brain healthy? Learn new things. And the thing I like the best is learn dancing because those dance steps is involved with coordination, exercise, music, all things great for your brain. There you go. Dr. Amen, thank you very much for joining us this morning. Do appreciate you. it.